pipes that have drug residue in them would no longer. People in possession of a, a low amount, a small amount of drugs um, will not be, there. there is the opportunity for them to not be arrested. And so what happens instead of being arrested? Um, those folks are given a hundred dollar ticket or they are given the opportunity to get a voluntary health assessment that would connect them to a broad range of services. Oregonians um, are in a state which is near last when it comes to access to substance treatment um, and have really high rates of incarceration around, or really high rates of arrest around um, drug possession. I'm excited to see what this measure brings. Of me when I first got arrested, currently pursuing a bachelor's degree in criminal justice and criminal. Absolutely, people should get another chance at um, recovery. You know, some people. There's people in prison right now that didn't get this chance. Less than a gram of methamphetamine would likely fall under Measure 110. So you can see the the black tar substance. Law enforcement leaders in Oregon are really concerned that we're going to see an increase in overdoses, overdose deaths, that we're going to see an increase in drug abuse, that we'll see an increase in crime associated with drug abuse because people who have substance use disorder still need drugs to maintain their life. The Measure 110 limits to those would still be...